My garage, half an hour. And bring my son. I let myself in. You could do with a stronger lock. Where's Raymond? Is that my money? Well, I'd come and see what all the fuss was about. I see Junior doesn't like being left out. How's the hearing? Is that your grad? Dad, no. I need more time to get a rest. I asked for 150 not a deposit. Yeah, well, you scammed us out of five grand last week, so who's to say you ain't gonna do it again, eh? You call that a scam? 80 grand now. More to come, and then what? Like, that shit could be bleeding you dry for years. <sighs> you know, you're really starting to get on my nerves. Good. Do not give her the money. All right, don't give her anything until she hands Raymond over. Is that why someone shot him? To shut him up? Who the hell do you think you are? All right, all right, that's enough, OK? I suggest you have a long, hard think about how much Raymond is worth to you. Well, more than he's worth to you. I mean, <laughs> who sells their grandkid? Uh, I said that's enough. Dad, right? Dad, you cannot trust her, OK? She's taking you for a ride. Haven't you any control over him? If you're going to get Raymond back, you've got to do it legit, OK? You've got to get the lawyers involved, you've got to get the courts involved, all right? You can't let her play you like this. Ben's right. You ain't getting another penny. I can see you have some things you need to sort out, so I'll give you some time. But I'm warning you, you don't want to mess me around. I told you, you ain't getting another penny. But you want a war? You got one. 